it was another successful year for tourism in Ireland. We had 3% growth in overall tourist numbers, particularly strong growth in the United States, up 15.5%, um, Europe up 4%, um, Spain um, up over 10%. Um, the only glitch, I guess, in that context uh, was uh, tourism from Britain, which was down 7%, and that was a trend which started earlier in the year and continued right up to year end. So uh, that is obviously a worry and a concern uh, and a key focus for the industry in 2018. Um, the, um, uh, I guess the outcome of, of Brexit phase one um, was positive from the industry's point of view in that the common travel area uh, is being preserved. Um, we, we should have a seamless border, uh, yet to be seen how that's going to operate. Obviously that comes to phase, phase two. Um, and a regulatory, uh, 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 regula a regulatory um, I guess, parity in the context of, of, uh, of the current situation that we have in terms of trading between North and South. Um, looking forward to, um, to, I suppose, the other, the other factor I should mention, which is really crucial, um, the, the value of, of tourism to the economy was 8.7 billion uh, in 2017. Uh, of that, just under 5 billion came from overseas uh, tourists, um, and that was a 6% increase in the previous year, so uh, in increasing in value, which is obviously very important to the industry. Uh, and again, I w uh, the standout there, I guess, is the increase in American tourists, but the fact that when they come to Ireland, they uh, spend longer here, um, they spend more here, and they also travel more widely. So the regions enjoy uh, a, a great benefit from American tourists. Um, domestic tourism was worth 1.9 billion to the economy, and obviously as the economy has recovered, uh, so too has the inclination of the Irish um, population to spend more time um, uh, taking breaks uh, in Ireland, and that's good news. And also we, we, we would have 300, 000, uh, 300 million euro in revenue from Northern Ireland tourists uh, in the Republic of Ireland. So that's how the 8.7 billion uh, hangs together. Um, looking forward to 2018, uh, we would see no reason to think that the industry shouldn't be able to deliver a 5% volume increase and perhaps a 7% volume increase, uh, sorry, value increase. Um, uh, and in the context of all that, probably generate another 10,000 jobs in the industry. And again, worth pointing out that the industry now employs 230,000 people, um, which, so it's the largest indigenous employment sector in the country. Um, and we think delivers uh, somewhere over uh, 2 billion euro um, in tax revenue to uh, the government and to the state. 